Hey what's up guys today I'm going to show you how to make a cloud high score system which also gets the username so let's get started So yeah I have an example here you can see my score is 0 the high score is 5 and the person who reached this high score was thinking 784 so we need to cross that to put our name here so when I click 1 2 3 4 5 and now 6 Yeah you can see my username is now here and this is exactly what we going to make so let's get started so we'll start by making some variables so the first variable we'll make is high score which will be a cloud variable to so check this and click on okay and now we'll make the second variable which will be our high score player so this will store our username the player who reaches the high score will get his username on this variable but in number format check on cloud variable click on okay and now we'll make a variable for high score player display so this will be our on computer variable which will store the real username and there are a lot of uses so this should not be a cloud variable do not check on that for all sprites click on okay then we'll make the score variable which will store our score and here we have the important variables and then we'll make a list which will contain our letters and symbols so we can convert numbers to letters so we'll name this letters and symbols for all sprites click on okay and now we'll add some items and now to add items first of all add nine empty items then the 10th one you can start typing letters so a then b then c then d and so on and you have put all the letters and now we'll add some symbols you can add as many symbols as you want the more you put it would be better and i have put 10 of them so the total is 45 you cannot exceed 99 or it would glitch out your game so just keep that in mind and here we have everything we need so you can just make this hidden and now let's get started with the coding so first of all we'll make the high score system so it will be like setting the score if we just break the high score record it will set the high score to our score so when the green flag clicked forever if put a greater than operator if score is greater than high score it will set the high score to score so this is our high score system that was that was pretty easy and now we'll get the username in the high score player variable so this will be the variable which will contain our username information but in format of numbers and we'll also make a method to decode that but first let's make a block called convert for cloud it will convert for the cloud variable and here we have the block so now first of all we'll set the high score player variable to blank so we can set it then we'll set the high score player display to username so we can get the username and finally we'll make a variable for the script to work is anchor for the sprite only this should not be a cloud variable click on okay and make it hidden now set anchor to 1 and now we'll start the main script so repeat put a length of operator in this and put the high score player display variable here so repeat length of high score player display put a set block here set high score player to first put a join block here and in the first space you can put high score player and in the second we'll put the main thing so we'll get the number from item number of thing so instead of this number we will put here letter anchor of high score player display and put it here so high score player display is a username anchor is now currently 1 so it will be like letter 1 of our username which is f and f's item number in letters and symbols let's see that so it is 15 so high score player will be 15 and now we need to change anchor by 1 and it will do the same for every one of them if else letters and symbols contain and you can just put here this letter anchor of high score display display so that it will check if it is there or not and in else you can just put change anchor by 1 and now this is it this is for this script and now we'll make the script which will convert these numbers to the real letters and that is pretty simple and way easier than this so we'll make a block convert from cloud it will convert the cloud format to normal format first of all we'll set the high score player display to blank so we can set that variable then set anchor to 1 and now you can put a repeat block and then you can put a divide block here and in the first you can put your length of block here and in that you can put high score player this is the cloud variable and in the dividing you can put here 2 so we'll divide it by 2 because we'll have only two digit numbers here so then you can just set high score player display to you can put a join block here in the first you can put high score player display and in the second you can put here the main thing we'll i am going to tell you so it will be item and any number of letters and symbols and in this number space we'll put a join block 
and we have two spaces. In the first space, we'll put letter anchor of high score player. And in the second one, we'll put anchor plus one of high score player. So just put them like this. And now change anchor by two. And this script is ready. And now you can just put these two blocks here. Convert for cloud and convert from cloud. And now we just need to reset the values. So we'll set the high score to like anything we want, like six. And we'll set the high score player to blank. We'll set the high score player display to also blank and we'll set core to zero. So you can just put the script back and let's see the magic. So when I start the project here, you can see the high score is six and my score is zero. So I need to reach six so to change for this project. I am just doing it like change score by one from here. So one, two, three, four, five and six. And now when I reach seven, here you can see my username is converted to numbers and that is converted to my real username and that pretty much works and this will work with anything you want you can put this in your game and this will work fine so this all for this video hope you guys enjoyed smash like if you did thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next video